Hello everyone, welcome back to some more Jack and Dexter Let's Play. Today we're in Rock Village, and it's gonna be a rocky time. Rockin', rock, rockin' the time. Rock. 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 Rock puns. They don't work. <laughs> welcome back to some more Let's Play. Jack and Dexter, Pukusu Legacy, or should I say the Rock Legacy, right about now. If anything, we need to be doing... Is getting the oracle real quick, and we had to grab all the bigger so orbs on the rock village first before we head into any other levels. And someone's talking to me, and I don't really care right now. Oh boy! Yeah, talk, 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 blah, blah, blah. You know the usual stuff that the precursor guy's talking about. Pfft, it's nothing. Anything? Oh, no way. Definitely not a foreshadowing deal upon what's going to happen in the future. Okay, let me just go ahead and get this on. How many orbs do we have? 70? Okay, well, we need like maybe more before we talk to her. She will ask for some power cells. There's a scout right back here, as you can tell. Looks like a few recursive orbs. Um, where is that little other blue eco at? Ah, here it is. And here is a scout fly, of course. Now, what you want to kind of do here is you kind of want to not do what I'm doing and being stupid. And you kind of want to run. Oh, we're not going to make it. There's no way. It's too far. Yeah, let's see. It's, 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 it's too far. Where is the dang... There it is. Okay. It's right there. And I am not 100% sure of how to get it. It's really difficult to do. This is a way to do it. But I kind of don't recommend my way because my way kind of sucks, like always. Yeah, we had it too. We would have had a little more blue eco in us. You see, that's what they kind of want you to do. They want you to grab this blue eco and be really, really fast with it. No, Jack, don't jump, you moron. That's why you keep screwing me over. Mm. I, I can grab both. I just don't remember how to. What if I do this one back here? What? what, what? Where'd it go? Where'd it go? Where's the blue eco go? Huh. And he runs right into a rock. And yeah. See, if we just grab a tad bit more of blue eco, we should be able to make it. See, there you go. You want to roll from one to the other as fast as you can, and then you want to grab those. That's kind of how I guess you can do it. Let's talk to her real quick. You two look like a couple of capable fellows. I've got a research project going, and maybe you could help me out. Hey, we're the ones on a big quest here. We had you for help. We can help each other. I've been studying the burrowing habits of lightning moles in the precursor basin next to our village for years. But now those awful lurkers have scared the moles to the surface. And since they're blind as bats, they can't find their way back underground. If you could herd them back into their burrowing tunnels, you might just save their lives. I've got a power cell that says you can do it. Yeah, lightning mole. We can. Maybe for two power cells. Nice try, but I would be willing to part with another power cell if you two find me 90 precursor orbs for my research equipment. Fair enough? Yep, that's meant to what to do. Oh, 90 yeah. orbs to the gynecologist for her yeah, research. Eh? Geologist? Oh. Well. Some people can dream, I guess. Anyway, we have to go to the precursor basin whatever the hell this place is called, and do that. We're not going to do that first. We have to do a, talk to a few people to unlock a few things so that we can get it going. We're going to talk to a lot of people, so get ready for this. Ah, talking in this game. It's great, isn't it? As you can see, he also wants a few for himself. A few power cells and... Power... 
cursor orbs. Oh, my aching head. I thought that's one of your vital organs. Walk it off, tough guy. Oh, sure, I was tough once. Maybe even the toughest of them all. I single-handedly defended this village from those horrid creatures for almost a year. Then that horrible monster arrived and commenced the Boulder Bombardment. So, full of valor, armor shining in the sun, I climbed the hill to take him on. But he pounded me like one tenderizes a yakow steak. Have you tried attacking him with your melodrama? Cause it's killing me! After my last stunning failure, he sealed the passageway to his roost with a 30-ton boulder, leaving no way for anyone to challenge him again. So, our sage, a master of blue eco, and a mechanical genius, devised a machine capable of lifting the boulder out of the way? But alas, he disappeared before we had a chance to turn it on. And he took all of his power cells with him. At least I was able to pull enough pontoons out of our bridge to prevent that monster from coming down here to do me harm. Yeah, good, good job, tough guy. But um, we're, we're gonna need you to uh, put him back and stuff. Oh, sure. And seal my doom? <sighs> all right. Fine. Bring me 90 precursor orbs and I'll let the pontoons loose. But I'm not going to fight that monster again. So yeah, the hero is the zero. Okay, let's see. Where would my precursor orbs be if I was precursor orbs? Because I got this backwards, I usually come this way last. But now I somehow, for some reason, always come here first. Makes no sense to me at all. There's that scout fly. As you can see, there's a little island all the way over there. But we don't really have to go there yet. Well, I'm not really going to try yet. Okay, how are we missing so much? So much. That little zoomer area doesn't really necessarily count towards Rock Village. Hold on, let me see. Of course we got, you know, the beautiful, okay. Oh, that's Precursor Bison. Bison, whatever. Okay, we're missing. Oh, I'm, well, eh, I know where one scalp light is. That's for sure. Alright, we might have to just go to a level and see what happens. Might as well just do this one for now. This one's not really hard, even though it says like it's like 200 level. 200 orbs, but you can probably get it done before you even know it. To be honest. Yeah. Oh my God. Okay. First things first, we have to get these stupid moles in there, and not to mention we have to take down these lurker guys. I'm always gonna do that first. Or at least try to take this guy down. It's not really hard. It's just annoying. Not to admit, you know what? Okay, let's get these moles in there. The moles are blind, if you didn't really hear. Oh, we didn't. But just in case, they are blind and they can't really know where they're going. So I have to kind of lead them into this. This is going to be a very long level. It's short in its own way. Just for me, it's going to be that. Just get in there. There's one. Let's go find. Well, the other two are right here, but they won't go. You think being blind would make you stupid, but no offense to blind people, but jeez, these freaking moles are retarded. He just passed his, he just passed the hole too. He's like, oh, oh. of course you didn't see it, but you could, you know, maybe have your foot falling in on accident, and you just didn't recognize it. That's that's pretty smart, and you know. Why can't the other little chupacabas like yell at him or something and be like, hey, we're in here? Even though they're blind, it doesn't mean they can't talk. Or whatever they do to communicate. Oh my god, I hate chasing these guys down. There's like five or four of them, I think. 
I don't really remember how much there was, but I just remember them pissing me off. As you can tell, Mr. Diver Rush over here won't hold the frick still. See, you, you drive right over them and then you miss them and then it's over. So, they go in a certain path, too, so you don't really have to try to train yourself to know that much. Oh, there we go, got him. Yeah, they dropped about five eco, maybe. So if you even... Yeah, they're, they're worth the eco, I guess. Other than that, they're not really much of anything. And not to mention, there are three parts to this level. Or three technical areas you can go into, as we can see if we're going to the next area right now, which we're not going to do. We're going to get this first area done as best as we can. Basically meaning... I don't know how I saw into that as being a legit box, but I did. I thought it was a crate. An eco, green eco crate. But it was a dark eco crate. I think, no, oh, they spawned back. Of course they do. Of course they do! Let's try to chase this guy down real quick. This is where the game gets kind of a little annoying. And by kinda, I mean a lot. There will be some levels I'm just going to completely just rage at, and this is probably going to be the one I know for sure. So expect some rage. I'll just grab all the cursor orbs and say, screw this kid. Yeah, like always, guys, sorry about the cutting here, but I just want to go ahead and say something right now. This will be really, really random what I'm going to say right here, right now. When I was editing episode 7, I accidentally deleted the next part of my commentary to this video. This is a half live, half post com video right now. Which is may seem strange. This is legitly post com in this section of the video. It's only three minutes left. I just want to go ahead and explain a few things what I did on accident. I'm kind of stupid. I was getting a little ragey right here. I didn't really say much of anything anyway. Of course, I had to cut it. A few things went wrong, as you can tell. I was talking about this, these purple rings, I don't like this level, blah, 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 this, this, that, and... Yeah, I accidentally deleted the second half of the commentary, so now I have this commentary to do. And I died, of course. <laughs> so I just want to go ahead and make this new, new one now, while I can. I'm actually going to record another episode in a few minutes, and I saw that my commentary was gone, and I was like, okay, where'd it go? And then all of a sudden, bam, it was deleted, and I'm like, okay, well, not now. So, I'm gonna do a post-com real quick, and I'm gonna do a real, real quick post-com. Of course, this probably will be uploaded for a while anyway. That is after episode 7. I mean, episode 7 is uploaded right now, as it is. I just uploaded it, and now I'm, I'm gonna go through this. Recording and uploading times are different between, you know, different commentators and stuff, so. And of course I missed a precursor orb right there. Uh, of course I won't. And I think I tried to do the race in this one. Or was that the last earlier before part? I don't know. Yeah, I think I... No, no, I don't. That no. Whatever, anyway. You had to chase down these damn bulls still and all that good stuff. And still chase down the guys with the diapers. It's really annoying. I completely hate precursor base. Bison, whatever, and I think I just skip them all, and I just go straight to the um, racing part, and then I kill myself because I'm just like, eh, I really don't feel like it, and then I said something like, I wish these things would actually die when you run into them because it pisses me off. Extreme rage throughout this entire level. I told you, it's gonna be a ragey level. It's okay. Percursive bison is not hard. It's annoying, is what it is. It's constant going back and forth through it. It's like three areas to this. There's a race and all that. That's about it, but nothing else. Oh, God, it's annoying. But I want to get to it as fast as I can. I actually screw up the time, so I said, F it. I'm going to die right here. I tried to jump off, but that didn't work. So I just decided to go ahead and end it. So I guess until the next video, I decided to re re end it this time. I will see you guys next time. So, yeah. Peace out, I guess.